See? Like that. Okay, Katie, give it a whirl. I'm gonna kick you in the face. Welcome back to Story of Seasons. Today we're gonna be participating in the fall concert. Which I think I did before, but I don't remember, like, what it was. So. Welcome everyone to this year's concert! Woo! Unfortunately, we cannot get One Direction, so this is all we've got. Elise on the violin! Ugh. Miss Mistel on the contrabass! Lily on the flute! And some chick I've never seen before on the piano! What do I get to do? No, then let the concert begin! Oh, I guess I don't get to do anything. Can you participate in the concert if you have a piano in your house? Because I know you can buy one from Mistel's antique shop. That's interesting. I would like to know that. Because otherwise, like, what's the point? It's like, I want to do stuff. In Harvest Moon Back to Nature, when they would do the fall concert, they would ask you if you wanted to play the ocarina. Which was cool. I mean, not that, like, it's not like I controlled it, but still. It was still cool. Nice little touch. This doesn't sound like the heavy metal I requested. Mistel. Hmm. I was abrupt. I don't think Giorgio and I were impressed. <laughs> Thank you very much for the wonderful performance. Let's give a warm round of applause to these fine musicians. Yay! Not impressed. Look at me, I'm like... Tss. This concludes this year's concert. I hope you all had a pleasant afternoon. Thank you so much for coming. We hope to see you again next year. Yeah, whatever. I just want to see my boo. My boos. No, not boos. <laughs> B-O-O-S, not B-O-O-Z. Blah, 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 blah. I only talk to you people to get friendship points with you, not because I actually like you. Well, some of them I like. Camille? Wait. So Camille's at a blue heart now. Because that's what that means. Because the purple heart is the dots, like the ellipses. So, also, Rieger's at a red heart. Oh, I'm pretty sure. Like, I always get confused because the pink and red look really similar. But, um... That was a great concert. I like playing instruments myself, but for me it's more like just a hobby, I guess. But listening to them jam like that reminded me how much more practice I need before I'm good enough to play in front of an audience. Oh, he's shy. He's shy about his music. <sighs> oh, I'm sleepy. This kind of music ain't really my style. It's okay, precious. I don't remember if I needed anything or not. Is it Rose Country? It is Rose Country. I feel like I wanted to check and see if they had any new stuff, because they haven't been here yet. At least I don't think so. Oh, I, I could buy a balloon. A durable balloon that can keep you aloft. If you use it... Who knows where you'll drift to, but remember, you can't use- What? What? Guys! What is this? Nobody ever told me about this. What is this? I- I want it. And it's a tool! What? What? I am so confused. <laughs> what is it? I want it. Oh my goodness. Okay, well, I'm gonna get white rose seeds. Oh, um, somebody was asking about cotton, like, how to, uh, like, growing cotton. Rose Country sells cotton, so there you go. <laughs> you can get it and then just, um, put it in the sewing studio. I don't know, I might make a video about the best ways to make money. 
if that is something that you guys would like to see. I know that some of you who like watch like really carefully already know all that or you've figured it out for yourself, but you know, there might be other people who um, don't have time to watch 50 some episodes of this and might just want, you know, tips like that. So I might do something like that if you guys are interested. Oh, and they're selling Jersey cheese, Jersey yogurt. I can make that shit myself, son. Truffle. An expensive ingredient from a distant island used in the finest gourmet cooking and known as the diamond of the kitchen. Interesting. I always loved truffles in um, Back to Nature because they sold for so much money. It was very useful. And he sells these. I wish you could find these. Um, like mint and stuff for tea. If there's any way that I can get that without having to buy it, can you guys let me know? Because that would be really nice. Because then I could um, make a lot of uh, tea stuff. Mixed salad, spaghetti soup. That's weird. I'll do mixed salad, buy that. Quiche, just, which just looks and sounds disgusting. Ratatouille. I don't know what that is. Spanish omelet, I can try that. I don't know. I just- I've been buying up recipes as I see them. Obviously I haven't bought too many just because... Like, from certain vendors I haven't bought too many because, like, I don't have a grape tree or, you know, I don't have a lot of these yet, so... I feel like I'll wait on those. But some of them I buy just because I want to have, like, all the recipes eventually. So let's see. A golden cone. Ooh. A gold conical decoration spangled with stars. Western bed? Western style bed with comfy fitted sheets. Is this tempur -Pedic? Is that a tempur -Pedic bed? Two layered shelf, compact bookshelf, two shelves. I don't trust you in your freaking compact bookshelf after last time. Wallpaper with pink checkered pattern, blah 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 blah. Oh yeah, colorful barn. I kind of want to make that, but... I don't know. White rose. Okay. So this is the colorful coop. So I could, once I grow white roses, I can make that maybe? Maybe I'll, um, maybe I'll actually get some more rose seeds. I have the money. It's all good. Pattern? Oh yeah. I wanted to see right. Fall and winter set. All right. Oh, that's going to hurt, but I'm going to buy it because we need to start making stuff for the fall fashion thing. Also, the balloon, what is the balloon? I wanna use it, can we use it? Let's do it. What's gonna happen? What's gonna, oh my goodness, what is happening? What? Why, why am I still, shouldn't it have taken me somewhere else? Am I, I don't, I don't even know if I'm doing this right. I'm gonna, I'm gonna try it like everywhere. That's so weird! <laughs> like, what is it? Oh my gosh, he wants autumn tea leaves. I don't know if I have enough to give him for that. <laughs> Freaking, I'm the queen of tea leaves. The tea queen. That's actually pretty good. I mean, I have a ton of those and I'm getting some nice stuff from it, so... I mean, he always gives me cannolis for some reason. Like, I don't know if that's just the dessert of his people or what, but he's always giving me cannolis. <laughs> Which I find funny. I don't really like cannolis that much, though. Like, I, I find them to be underwhelming. You know, if I'm gonna... I guess, like, now... Obviously not when I was younger and I would eat whatever the crap I wanted, but now that I'm older and, like, calories matter, I feel like if I'm gonna eat a dessert, I'm gonna damn well like it because I'm not gonna just... I'm not gonna just, you know, eat eat something sweet just because it's there. Wait, is the balloon a one-time use thing? Are you shitting me? I think it is. What is the point of that? Somebody explain to me why. <laughs> Please. I'm offended. That didn't even take me anywhere. It was not fun. Upset. I have one grass drink left. Here you go, buddy. Alright. Well, we're doing pretty well. We have 
uh, <laughs> two guys at a red heart. And all the other ones are at various stages. Fritz is the lowest, he's at a purple still. I remember this one time in Back to Nature. I worked so hard to get all the girls to like a red heart. <laughs> Just because. Just for fun. See, I've been playing since I was a little kid. <laughs> oh, that's wrong. Okay. Oh, I guess I could check on my, my oyster. I forget that it's in there. I don't even have to like put food or anything in there. At least I don't think so. Pearls aren't big enough yet. Okay. Well. Alright, so we're gonna read about this. When you use the balloon, you'll immediately float away to a random area in Oak Tree Town. It cuts down your travel time if you were headed to town anyway, so make good use of it. Huh. But it's only a one-time use, and it's expensive. It's not like you can make it or anything. I don't think it's worth it. Kira, have you a Acclimated to farm work yet, in recognition of your effort so far, we present you with the title of Proficient Rancher. We hope you will continue to grow and expand your farm. Oh, I will. Because I'm fabulous like that. <gasps> Ooh, lemons! I forgot about those. Alright. That's cool. I've just kind of started putting trees over here because... Why not? Okay, so I was just heading to the trading depot because there's a festival today and there's a person here so okay ooh this is definitely a rare specimen whoa so is this one this town is a treasure trove of excellent plant life I'm so glad I came Are you from Oak Tree Town? Yep. I'm not a loony weirdo, really. My name is Licorice. I'm a botanist. Yeah, the fact that your name is Licorice makes me think that you're a weirdo. Ah, so you are Keita and you're a farmer, I see. It's nice to meet you. You have cool hair. I've been told that there's an unusual amount of rare and interesting plants in this town. After hearing that, I had to check it out myself. Just exploring this area here, I've uncovered many strange plants. For example, look at this one. It's... <laughs> I don't care. <laughs> uh, pardon me. My excitement got the better of me for a minute. It's just that the thought of being able to research this town's plants and flowers gets me all fired up. I want to get started right away. You said you were a farmer, correct? I'm sure you must have interesting specimens growing on your farm. I'll be staying at the inn for a while. Can I pay you a visit sometime? Yeah, sure, whatever. Thanks. Now then, I have to be going. Plants to see, information to record. Oh, she's a little nerd. It's so cute. Very, very cute. Do you want to participate in the pet promenade? Yes, I do. Alright. We're not gonna win because my pets don't like me. But I still wanted to show this festival because I didn't enter it last year because I didn't have any pets. So, I thought we would still do it. Excellent. The festivities will begin shortly. Please wait just a moment. Like, I'm pretty sure I'm gonna come in last place. Because <laughs> I don't really play with my pets like I don't use the whistle or the or the bell or whatever I just don't I don't have time man you're lucky you're getting fed <laughs> welcome everyone to this year's pet promenade are you ready to see this year's finest animal friends sure without further ado allow me to introduce our contestants oh that lady that like nobody ever sees Nian the long-haired cat. Really? Nyan cat? Really? Okay. Entry 2, Margaret from Solis with Tora, the long-haired cat. Whatever. Why does everybody have cats? That cat is freaking huge. 
Baron the short-haired cat. Look at how big that thing is. What the heck? Entry four, Hyrule Farms, get it with Apollo the long-haired cat. Woo! Yay me. Now I have the honor of introducing our guest judge, the renowned animal trainer Wolfio, this creepy guy who never takes off this costume. Ah, we've met him before. He's quite scary. We will now begin the judging segments of the competition. Contestants, if you would please return to the waiting area. Thank you. Fine. Stupid Elise is gonna win. I just know it. That cat is huge. What is she feeding it? Seriously. Because those cats would just sit there <laughs> during this whole thing. Ladies and gentlemen, it seems the judging has concluded. I will now announce the winners. In first place... Yep, saw that coming. Yep, last place. Ugh. Well, at least I wasn't, you know, banking on it like I was with some of the other festivals where I was just like, seriously? But whatever. My sheep love me and that's all that matters, isn't it? Oh god, Fritz is in a blue heart now. Whoa, 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 whoa. What, what, what did you say? Hey, Kita, I don't know about you, but I'm getting real curious about that judge and what's hiding under that costume of his. Uh, th What? Oh, I know. How about the two of us work together and see if we can pull the mask off? Come on, let's put together a plan. Uh, all of a sudden, I just got a really bad feeling about that. Um, maybe save the planning for later. What the f- Sometimes, Rigor will tell me I'm like a dog. What do you think he means by that, exactly? That you're really annoying and up people's butts all the time? Oh wait, does he mean I'm really cute and smart and loyal? Oh my gosh, Fritz, you want Rigor so bad. Like... Oh my gosh. It's so obvious that he wants Rieger. Oh, now they're gonna stand together. Am I the only one who thinks that judge is creepy? I mean, what's up with that costume? I can't understand the people who think something like that is cute. I'm with you there, buddy. I totally understand what you mean. Oh, and Klaus is at a green heart, so check that out. Ugh, hey there, Kita, what you doing here? <laughs> you don't have to answer, I already know. It's obvious you come to ferret out the secret to farming success from your greatest rival, me. Guess what, you are not anywhere near my greatest rival, you really suck. Have you not seen my success? I really should keep my secrets to myself, but I can see in your face how much you want to know, so I guess I could show you. <laughs> So come on, follow me. You came at just the right time to observe my special watering techniques. Oh, God. I dislike you. Come on, what are you waiting for? Follow me. <laughs> angry spaghetti. All the angry spaghetti. Okay, I'm gonna demonstrate first. You can just watch for a second. First, I quit my watering can. Then I shove it up my ass. Then I face the field, I want to water and water away. Dude, I... Do I look like I'm new here to you? It is year two of fall. See? L like that. Okay, Katie, give it a whirl. I'm gonna kick you in the face. Ooh, 
What was wrong? Was there something you didn't understand? Whenever you're ready, just give it a shot. Whoa, not bad. <laughs> it's good to have a disciple who's a quick learner. I'm going to kick you so hard. You're an idiot. But to be honest, your form's a bit stiff. Why don't you practice on some other fields? I have almost all the fields. You do realize this. I'm only missing two, neither of which you own. Yeah, there you go. Go with the flow. I like it. Oh, right. If you run out of water, just get some more from the fountain. I have more crops in my one greenhouse than you have on your whole farm. Well, I guess you wound up doing all my watering for me. But all that practice has led you to perfect the secret watering technique passed down by the old masters. Now that you've learned that, you're going to be an even bigger rival than before. But I ain't going to lose to you that easily. I'm going to be the greatest farmer in this whole town. No, in the world! Oh my god. Anyways, better get back to work. See you around. I fucking hate you. Ugh. Thank you for a waste of my afternoon. Alright, I'm finally gonna buy the larger bag because I need it and I have enough money. I have almost two million, so I'm gonna buy this. Yes. Thank you, old man. So there's no larger bag after this. That's fine, whatever. Couldn't afford it anyway, jeez. What do you make these bags out of? Gold? Okay, so I finally made the last greenhouse. This is the autumn greenhouse. So I already have it all set up. All that good stuff. And uh, so that way I have, you know, one for every season. Very useful. I will probably reorganize because, I mean, it doesn't look that great right now. So, um... Eventually, I will do that, make it look a little better. But, um, yeah, so I didn't think of this, at, like, before I planted all these freaking trees. But if you plant a tree based on the season that it's in, like right now, lemon, I have this lemon tree and it gives me lemons because it's autumn. If I plant that in the autumn greenhouse, it'll continue to give me lemons throughout the year. Which I totally didn't think about. So... I'm actually going to be planting some trees in here, in these greenhouses, in the near future, because that just makes sense. I'm thinking I'll probably just leave these up and then, you know, just for some extra stuff, but I think the ones that I'm going to focus on, like, fertilizing and raising to five stars are going to be the ones in the greenhouses, so that way I can have fruit all year round. So if you've been following me on Twitter or if you're watching my Stardew Valley Let's Play, you'll know that I've been talking about streaming, which is something that I've been interested in getting into. And I was kind of thinking about why well, I want to stream Stardew Valley. I think that would be really good for streaming, like really relaxing. I was also thinking of maybe streaming um, some of this, like Story of Seasons. Not anything, you know, big like events or anything, but just kind of like the daily, you know, taking care of the crops, blah, 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 all that stuff. Just because I think it would just be really relaxing. We could just kind of hang out and talk. And if you guys wanted to ask me stuff, you could do that. It would be very laid back and just kind of like hanging out together. So. I do have a Twitch now, I got it all set up, and I'm basically just trying to learn how to stream via Twitch, but if that is something that you'd be interested in, definitely let me know, like comment about it, um, because I want to know where you guys are at with that. And you can definitely follow me on Twitch, the link should be in the description of all my videos now, I have all my social media links there, so if you want to follow me on any of them, feel free to do so. Um, but yeah, I thought that, uh... We could just kind of stream whenever I have the chance. So just let me know what you think of that idea, if you like it, or if you'd be interested in seeing that. 
I think I'm going to cut this video here. I was really hoping to get the Camille flower event and the Fritz flower event to be done with it so that, you know, we can move on and actually start pursuing pursuing someone because it's it's about time, you know what I mean? It's been long enough. I think uh, it's time to do that. So it just didn't work out like the days of the events. I've had so many rainy days and it's just, it has not been working out. So hopefully in the next one, we'll get both of those knocked out and then we can just start, you know, pursuing a certain someone. So thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you in the next video.